This video provides an overview of adding an existing CPU to LifeBeat monitoring and manually editing the LifeBeat picture. From WinCC Explorer of the server OS, open LifeBeat monitoring by right-clicking it on the left pane. Then select the Open menu choice. At the top of the LifeBeat monitoring editor, there are three columns. The device name is where you enter a symbolic name of your choosing that the operator will see. The device type allows you to select a block icon that will best represent this device. The connection column is where you select a pre-existing symbolic connection that LifeBeat monitoring will use to talk to this device. To start, double-click the first blank device name row and enter a name that represents the CPU. For this example, we'll enter AS90. Now double-click the same row under the Device Type column. Select the down arrow to expand a list of available device type icons. In this example, we'll select the AS-4XX to represent a 400 series CPU. Finally, double-click the connection column in the same row. Click the down arrow and select AS05 underscore PROG. This connection was previously created in Somatic Manager as the program for the CPU, shown here. To place and configure the AS-4XX block icon on the LifeBeat monitoring picture, we only need to click the Update button on the right. LifeBeat block icons have been automatically positioned on the picture. You can edit the LifeBeat picture by clicking the Edit Picture button at the bottom right. The LifeBeat picture is opened in Graphic Designer. Here you can edit the graphic and move the block icons around. Don't forget to save when you're done. If adding additional devices to an edited LifeBeat management picture, you should add your additional devices, click the User Define selection. This will cause the existing objects to not be touched and add the new devices to the top left of the picture. Click the Update button to add the new devices to the picture. Click the Edit Picture button to manually edit the picture and move the new device icons where you want them. Close the LifeBeat Monitoring Editor. Don't forget to watch LifeBeat Monitoring Part 2, Adding an OS, and Part 3, Runtime View.